What's up YouTube? It's another episode of the How To Guy and today we're looking at eight different cinematic, I think we might do nine, I'm not sure, we'll see how many we can cram into this video. We're doing eight or nine different cinematic tips. You can use different shooting techniques using your Osmo Pocket. I'm going to show you examples as I go. Let's get started. So one of the first shots I want to show you today is using the Andor motorized dolly. I want to do like a scene where a man's got an axe and he walks into a house and I'm going to show you how you can use perspective and your Osmo Pocket and this motorized dolly, the Andor motorized dolly, to create some movement in your scene. Okay, so I have my Osmo Pocket for the first scene. You see this little wooden beam? This is the wooden beam that's going to give me a little bit of perspective. I also have it mounted to the Andor motorized dolly and I've got a little remote control that allows me to actually move this thing. Start recording with your DJI Mimo app. Get your handy X. Place it down. The Osmo Pocket is tracking me at the moment. Also going to use this monopod type thing it's a manfrotto monopod but the cool thing is at the bottom it's got a little tripod mount and in the andor motorized dolly it's got a tripod mount so look what i'm going to do i'm going to screw that thing in so what i'm going to do is i'm going to mount the osmo pocket on top of this tripod i'm going to turn it on i'm going to remotely control this thing while i'm doing the scene that should give us a bit of a cool perspective when doing walking shots by the way i'm going to use some of these lights they are rgb lights and they give you a little bit of sort of a cool Hollywood cinematic look, the different colors. So we'll try use a little bit of a color. See, we have the room slightly lit to like a purple color back there. Now it's important not to use any kind of tracking. Just keep the Osmo Pocket horizontal. So let me turn it around, point the camera sort of upwards. I think this is going to come out quite nicely. Have a look at this video and then we'll carry on with some more cinematic tips. Okay, so this is the next scene and I'm going to use the motorized dolly again. I've got some lights set up. We're going to try to do like a Hollywood type scene where you turn the chair around to reveal the face of whoever. The... Make sure you test out which direction your motorized dolly is going because you don't want it to go off the edge of a table. I've tested this out already. Another cool shot you can do with your Osmo Pocket are sort of low angle power shots. They give the character in your scene a lot of strength. Position your Osmo Pocket on top of the middle of those stairs, face track yourself using the app, and then walk up the stairs slowly. Keep looking forward at all times, and it, sh it should give you that cinematic look that you see in the movies. Note, you might need to track yourself twice, once walking up the one set of stairs, and once walking up the second set of stairs. This is like an automatically balanced 90 degree pole. I've used two different selfie sticks and this has a 90 degree connector. This allows me to float my Osmo Pocket down low and the balance point is actually pretty good. You can get super smooth cinematic shots using this method. One of the best shots you can do with the Osmo Pocket is a Hollywood type dolly shot. That's when you sort of tuck your Osmo Pocket in between your arms and you push, position it backwards and make sure you hold this kind of sturdy. Then you use face tracking and make sure tilt locked is enabled on your Osmo Pocket. That's the magic part of this formula that makes it work. To get kind of like interview type shots, the ones where you see when people have caught like a really bad guy and he's sitting in an interview room and you put it in black and white. Let me show you what I mean. We're going to use a little clamp that I have. Cool thing about this clamp is you can mount your Osmo Pocket to the clamp and you can mount this clamp on almost anything thick and sturdy enough. So you want to aim your Osmo Pocket down, pointing downwards at like a 90 degree angle. Let me show you what you can do. 
This man was responsible for the largest gold heist in the 21st century. He refuses to eat or drink. He has no family and we cannot get a word out of him. He refuses to speak to a lawyer. What are our options, sir? Here's another tip. The Osmo Pocket can actually track you through Windows. This is a really useful Hollywood shot that you can use. Use in your Osmo Pocket, place it inside any glass cabinet or anything you're opening up. Put it in there, just push record, open the cabinet up, look at the cool effects you can get. The next thing you can do is get Hollywood type drone shots using this extended long selfie stick. You can see the actual joints come out, it's still going. You can do some drone shots of the building. That's the end of this video. If you found it useful, please hit the subscribe button. It really helps my channel. If anything in this video resonates with you, then please watch some of my other videos. I do kind of similar stuff and show you how to do different things using cameras, photography, filmmaking. See you again next time.